We're live. Da da da. So B, I know that you're prepping this, and we should have been more prepared because people said so. Um, he's using 400 grit extra fine sandpaper. Well, that's the second time I sanded it. For the second sand cycle. And ask him what, what this looks like with just these lights. Don't turn that off. Okay, okay. Hi, Christina, Tandy, what's up? How's the lighting, y'all? Like, if we just have just, just these two on, how does that look? Or should we have more lights on? I don't know, better Do one? More or less blankets? Or two? Better, better one or two? One, uh, one or two. <laughs> Everybody says two. So we don't need this light behind us. Probably not. I, I want to see what it looks like. Well, we'll walk around here. I have it all. Are we at the eye doctors? Basically, yes. While he's setting up, I want to show y'all this um, piece that I finished today. I did a cupcake. I did a cupcake. I did a cupcake. All the glitter, y'all. Took a couple minutes to finish. Listen, I want a glittery cupcake in every color ever made. And I was like, okay, okay, okay. Challenge accepted. And then that's what happened. Also, y'all, I got to tell you a sad story. I made a piece last night that I pretty much almost wanted to just keep forever. And... I put it in my bun pan rack and the pan was slightly bent. It was damaged. It was damaged in transit, but I wasn't paying attention. And then, B, will you hand me my accidental waterfall pour? And then it did this. <laughs> I think it looks good. It looks amazing. So Who now, it'd be a one of a kind, eh? I know. But I, I love it. I mean, it would look better as a, like a coffee table piece. Dude, it's so dusty. How is it so dusty? Because we cleaned in here, and by we, I mean you did oh, an amazing job. <laughs> I know, people are like, I like it, and I think you guys are sweet. However, it was one of my favorite Shit, pieces. So good. It definitely, definitely could have been worse. I think it's interesting, this part, and you can't see it on camera, obviously, but there's still so much depth because I had such a thick layer of clear. But I think it still looks like a flower. I still like the movement in it. Hey, with Tony said, I bet you it sells. We will see. P.S. It's available. And... I had it priced at 75, but I'll probably mark it down after this. Choice of color, it cost me more than $20 to get it to you. What's up, Kelly? Who is that? Happy Friday, y'all. Um, I told Judy I would test out. How about 100? I would accept 100. Where's Write my, that down. I know. Where's my notebook? 
Have you found the masterpiece from yesterday yet? Oh. <laughs> I'm assuming they mean this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hi, France. Hey, Sugar. Sharon. Oh, thank you, Sharon. I will definitely add it to your pile. What we'll do is we'll put this on. That makes my whole night better, Sharon. Can you see it? Probably not. I know what I'll do. We'll make it to where they can see it through. See through it. So this is Jeff's um, pour from yesterday on Plexi. That would be my very first that. <sighs> Thank you, Trace of Color. If you move the light down into like, yeah, now it looks like it's supposed to be there. Now watch. What am I watching for? Is the sun rising? The sun rising. Does it look like it? Yes, it does. <laughs> now. It's the sunset. Does it look like it? No? <laughs> it definitely looks cool either way. And then if it's party night. No, no more party. I like it. I think it's uh and when it does let's see. Just imagine the sunlight. You can kind of see the orange through it. It definitely acts like a stained glass window. It does. Very suave. Hello. Debbie, you can absolutely hang it in your family room you if can. Jeff tells me. Piece. Christina, we have not sold this one yet. Well, Kenneth, it because... should be banana yellow. I would love to do another one too, like just a little bit bigger, tape off the back. Um, I think, how, what did we say? You didn't say. I say like 125. Oh, Debbie asked one last night how much. Um, he said 125. Also, for everybody that was wondering, we tried to peel these off, like to see if it would come off since we didn't prep this. Um, Plexi, Debbie said sold. Um, PayPal Venmo information. Um, so this, it doesn't peel off. So no prepping necessary. You can still see straight through it for everybody wondering about that. Plexiglass because you can't ship glass. There is no guarantee in that. Okay. Hi, Leanne. Debbie, I can send you an invoice. Um, that looks very dark. It's not. It, it bounces off your face really well when you're over there. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Um, I, do I have your email address, Debbie? Blue Star, we have done the heat gun and scrape method, but not on Plexi. I don't want to warp it, so what we're probably going to do is sand it down. I'm going to keep this. Yeah. I mean, Hi, Paulina. Can't trace with it. It's not paper. This is part of my cupcake. That's right, Debbie. I will definitely. 
um, invoice you after the show tonight. I'm making notes. Unless you just want to send it, um, email the same as PayPal. Awesome. Okay, you guys. Cheers. Tink. Chardonnay on deck. Okay. Where's my on deck? Oh. I'm getting it for you, love. So, as everybody... Yes, ma'am, Sharon, I will. Um, trace of color, I absolutely do not feel insulted at all. Um, Robin, my, my uh, video for doing the cupcake <laughs> cut out at one point, but I have another one on order almost probably after the end of tonight i'll have that one on order so i gotta do another one anyways i might do a live feed for it but it's a long one so we'll see um hey linda hey tracy i'm so glad all of you guys are here you're dying abby's hair pink that's amazing i want to dye my hair pink hug abby for me and what are you doing no snacking we're gonna go grill after this so as everybody in the poor, poor community um, that does resin pours knows, hey Melba, um, everybody wants to find the best white, right? Yes. Um, we need some white. And I have heard around the bush, mm, never mind, <laughs> I take it back, um, that no, this was supposed to be kind of bananas. So we're gonna test the banana-ness of system three. We'll put it for this one. That's what who's doing. Also testing tonight, mic check, is Art Tree. I am not in any way affiliated with Art Tree. They sent us a package, oops, sorry y'all, with some stuff. There are what is this? Epoxy. Everybody's getting in on the plum hype, but y'all know Artisu has my, in my opinion, for what I like to paint, my favorite plum. My needs. For my needs. No, I'm not sponsored by Nike. Just do it. So they have epoxy resin pigments that looks like she just printed out and stuck on here. There's, um, what is this? Epoxy pearl. Um, oh metal flakes. And resin paste H2O. I don't know what the difference is in how resin paste works versus, I mean, an H2O paste versus a regular epoxy paste. But you know what? We're gonna we're trying all the things out tonight. And as soon as my artist gets back over here from watching the sunset, we'll yeah. get started. It looks so amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and plug my phone in because reasons. Also, you guys. I'm one step closer to oh, here's how that turned out. You can see Jeffrey's face and everything through it. Oh, oh this. Yeah, Hi, Judy. So, tonight Jeff is going to test out System 3. He's also really trying to try this um, paint we got in the mail today. 
even though we are in no way affiliated with archery, Jeff just, it, some of the paints caught his eye, so he wants to try it, so he's trying it. Um, I, tonight, will be pouring orange, purple, and another color, but it's classified because I haven't thought of it yet. Yeah, yeah, we know. Ooh, ain't nobody want to break dance with me. Hi, Izzy. Thank Is you, you, Robin. Wiki, 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 wiki. Wiki, are you wrapping? Hey, I'm jam on it. Oh. Nucleus. So... Also, don't forget that we have our contributor donor giveaway, May 31st. Thank you to everybody that's already made the list. This is only half the list. It's going to be about to right here when I get everybody updated from this past week, but I'm a slacker because I've been doing everything else. So I'll have that updated soon for the contributor donor oh. giveaway on the 31st. We're also choosing our um, lupus pour giveaway for everybody that's used the hashtag ATDART, we're giving away three sets of sticks for people that have entered our lupus pour giveaway. You can enter still. You have till the end of the month. All you have to do is do a pour that's predominantly purple for lupus awareness. Edward, your sticks went out today. Also, Misty, your package went out. Also, who's the other one? Ron, if you're in here, your package is out. What happens if you pick someone who isn't watching for the giveaway? We give people one week to contact us to claim their prize. Otherwise, we 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 That's we draw. A long time. I know. <laughs> Especially for the loyal people. Jenny said, orange and purple are Clemson tiger colors. <laughs> <laughs> and by that, I mean roll tide. You don't say the C word here. The C word, not that C word. I'd rather any other C word. Is it contributing this month or overall? Uh, Rod, we do the contributor giveaway monthly, so... It's overall for the month. Carrie asks, y'all are so, 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 so close to 10K. What celebration are we in store for? Uh, gold Mylar balloons. I know that. <laughs> 24 karat gold plastic coated Mylar balloons. And then that's it. That's all we got planned so far. But we're going to do a giveaway um, on our 10K Whenever we hit we 10K. Go, we should go live and, rec like, can't we put it on a count countdown? The thing? ticker? Yeah. Like, it's on, like, I've seen them do it for a million, you know, or 100K people. Please hold. This is where we're at right now, y'all. Oops, classified. This is where we're at right now. This is our ticker. It shows where we're at as of the second the second the second so i can watch whenever we tick up to ten thousand. we will be going live like as it happens and we're going to do a pour and we'll do like a, a, a good size pour and give that pour away yeah during that video yeah um it'll be like a, a good size well, most of our giveaways are what, 10 by 10? So you want to do a 10 by 20? I don't know, maybe like a 15 by 36. Who knows? That's a lot of shipping. Well, they can put a little extra in there if they like. Contrib. Do you listen to music while doing your artworks, Jeff? Yes. Yes. I sure did, Andrea. I haven't had a chance to comment on all of them, but I did see them. And if you guys have emailed me, it is also amazing. Do negative space with white, orange, and purple. Ooh, that sounds very nice. 
Christina Welch. Thank you. You can get our stir sticks from our website, artisttilldeath.com, two T's, two L's. Um, we're open for sales in Australia, UK, and Canada. Just make sure that when you purchase them, you purchase the ones for um, your country because I've had people purchase the wrong ones, but that's okay. Or you can just shoot me an email Thornton at artisttilldeath.com, two T's, two L's, and I will, um, I can shoot you an invoice. Lori says Roll Tide because she knows what's up. Jenny, you can be a Gamecock fan. It's just friendly college rivalry and et cetera. I don't ever win anything, but in the slim chance I'll be away for a month with no phone, does that mean I'm SOL? Edward... You, you're telling me in advance, and so that's perfectly fine. Should your name get pulled, I will definitely hold your prize for you till you get back so you don't have to worry about it being on your doorstep. The one week is waived for you, sir. Thank you for your service. Bonnie, Color Obsession um, has a website. Hold on. Let me see if I can pull it up on the iPad. And... I should be carrying it by next month here in Texas, and so I can ship it out locally. No snow. You can find, oops, you can find it all at colorobsession.com.au, and you can see all of the colors oops and there are about a zillion of them and they are all brilliant b are you straight out of compton beyond you didn't miss much we just started can i use promarine lamination resin for a resin painting i ordered the wrong one paulina i i don't know i've never heard of it i've never tried it so i don't know firsthand but if you could send me a photo of like the labels um thornton at artist till death.com two t's two l's i will do some research for you Maybe. want to see a rose pour from last night did you pull that one out? Yeah. I didn't. I forgot about it. Oh. Did it move? That looks like it might be a little apparent. So, that one looks kind of like a rose. That one looks like a rose uh, blew up. up. There's depth in it, like you can see definitely like through the colors, like right here. I don't hate it, but I wish it was more of what I had in mind. Oh, but it's still like, it's like, what's that called when something, Impressionism? Impressionism? Maybe. I'm, I'm self-taught, so I don't know art words. <laughs> I don't know the art things. It is Impressionistic. And if you like hold it far enough away, it could be like a Renoir style, like that very like, loose bouquet i don't know it's available it's on a hundred dollar size but if someone wants it i'd let it go for 50 because it wasn't what exactly i had in mind but it's still not too shabby of a piece at all so 50 dollars. we got bills and stuff abstract that expressionism is, that's normally like a hundred dollar one I know, it is a $100 piece, but tis what it is. Ooh. I know, it'd be great to find a way to put that, the count on the screen, but I don't know how to do that. 
So till then, I just have it ticking. I, I saw these, these guys drawing. They were like in the Netherlands or something. And they had two cameras, one on, one on him drawing and the other one on the guy talking. And they had like a banner and like all this awesome like TV stuff. And obviously they were probably going through their computer. Mm -hmm. So I bet that's, this is very vibrant. And um, pretty transparent. the ticker is called live count by social blade. I'm so behind. You could do a wood chip resin bowl sample if you get a mold. If I, if I got a mold, I could. Lost in Nopo, thank you so much. Yeah, this Oh, thank you, black. Kelly. Teal, orange, and purple, that sounds good. What is that? This is Stormy Night. It almost has a blue hue from here, or like a deep purple. Look at that. Oh. That I'm sorry, good. Sheila. Oh. I'm sorry your neck is hurting beyond. Carrie, thank you so much for that. I really appreciate it. We got two tips so far, B. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. We love tips. Spam the like it's button, problem, peeps. I thank you, Toby. Tips. What? Tamara, where have you been? Chris wants to know how the plexiglass pour turned out. Turned out pretty dad blame amazing. As you can see, you can see right through it. It looks so movement. It looks like, like, <laughs> this is definitely some different gold here, kids. And it doesn't peel off. So if that was a concern for everybody, Samantha wants to know how the fisheye pour cured. I will show you guys in a minute. It cured exactly how we thought it would. It looks like a contemporary piece of art that somebody would sell for like $10,000. But we only sell it for a thousand. Right. <laughs> What's up, ideas? Hey, Crystal. What's up, Philly Phil? This is gonna be this is gonna be a transparent gold. Is what it looks like. I didn't even know that was a thing. I don't even know if that's like if that's gonna be any good. I might want to put a little bit more. I don't know if I like this. Um, Rod, canvas is a less and less wise choice the bigger you go. Um, I definitely recommend anything over probably a twenty-four by twenty-four pouring on a wood canvas. A wood canvas. You know what I mean. All right. Um, Eva, if you are going to pour over satin spray paint, I would definitely make sure you have plenty of resin down because the least flat your base coat is, the more risk you have of... You didn't put any clear down. Was that on purpose? Yeah. Okay. Hi, Simone. Call him out, Beyon. Lou, let me know how that resin turns out for you. Trace of color, make sure you um, shake that gold spray paint up a lot. Eva, you'll really like those Doc Martin India inks. Hi, art by me. Who else hit up Michael's today for the 70% off wrap canvases? All the way up, I right there. It. Five, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. I got like 13 or, or I probably got 15 canvases for $98. We spent $98 a day? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even know. Edward asks, does spray paint really melt plastic cups? Like you wouldn't you believe. Can, we can show you if you want. <laughs> Let me know if you want me to do a test on that. Hi, Cindy. 
What up, Laura Taylor? Still loving this table. You're the man slash the woman. Slash the woman. Carrie said, you're welcome. You saved me more than that by teaching me what not to buy. It's our pleasure is what we do it for. Thank you. Bonnie said, here's a tip. Help towards getting an assistant. Y'all for real, <laughs> I need an intern. Sheila, I have tried some of the metallics you sent us, and they're pretty great. Um, we did them for a client, a commission piece off camera, but I will definitely pull them back out and show you. We'll do another one. Tanya, if my contact in Canada doesn't mind redistributing the color obsession as well, I will definitely ship to Canada. Artfully Adrienne said, do I need house paint to prep a small canvas like an eight by 10? I think they are. Um, That's what I just did with this one. We just used house paint to prep this one, which is a 10 by 10. Um, if you wanted to, and you only had like acrylic paint, you can definitely use that. Um, Eva, you could sand it. Um, just be careful sanding spray paint because it will definitely scratch and you'll be able to see it through your resin. Simone, you haven't missed that much. We just started. This is the first piece. Rod says so many choices to use for coloring. It gets it confusing and overwhelming. It's, that's, I, I go through it daily. <clears throat> Hi, Christy from Palm Desert. Oh, man. That looks super thin. It does, doesn't it? Like, it's going to all wash off type of thin. Hi, Miss Carrie. Or it's just not going to go anywhere. <laughs> I don't think it looks bad. I think that definitely looks interesting on that fade up there. Idea says, I also just got fronted $100 for a commission. First art sale since I quit tattooing. Oh, wow. Awesome feeling. That's awesome ideas. Congrats. This is selling while it's stretching. <laughs> Lisa, I'm sorry you didn't have very much luck at your arts fair. Um... It's definitely not good when it's hot outside. People just don't get out. Um, I haven't tried any other cast and craft opaque resin dye other than the white. Typically, the white just works best, but I'll have to get my hands on some of the other colors. Um, see what they do. Hi, Mary Jane. Samantha, acrylic inks are not transparent. They're fairly opaque. That gold is weird. It is. It's, it's not very uh, bright. Choice of color. Let me know if you end up doing your bathroom in the pink um, marble. Laura Taylor? Is that a typo? What'd she say? She said, here's $99.99 to make it for the canvas purchase today. What? <laughs> you guys. I'm going to cry, I swear. You're spoiling us. I can't even put into words how much I appreciate every single one of you for just tuning in. And then with that, that's amazing. Billy Phil, I sure will. 
Eva, if it pits and your resin is still wet, just drop more resin into those areas. If it pits while you're not watching it and it sets that way, if it's a small pit, sometimes you can just lay a hot, like a rag over it and it might melt back into place. After it's set, don't do that with wet resin. Um, if that doesn't work, you have to sand your piece that is down. Such a weird looking gold. I know, it's kind of green. Well, I think it's because of this blue, but it's selling like a mofo. You'll have to sand it down and do a top coat. Hi, Barbara. Look at that. This stuff really sells up. Like, there's, there's no joke about this stuff. This art tree, like, you guys, it's, <laughs> look at that. I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do a, a puddle pour on that. I, I like this, like it's, that's super. Let me give you guys a little light up view of this. That, yeah. very I, shimmery. I wish we to use that other gold. Up. Hi, Cindy. I like that. The plexiglass turned out great. Looks like this. Very transparent. Very, um, it didn't peel off at all. Went well. I like that. Laura said you're the daughter I never had. We're coming to visit for dinner then. <laughs> What's up, Rusty? I know, she is a saint for sure. I like that a lot. Bonnie, it's our pleasure. Eva, that's basically what you need to do when you first get started. You just need to jump on in there. Just do it. It's like when you're at the lake, it's just... It's kind of cold. cold. You don't know if there's an alligator, but you just gotta jump in. Can't let what may happen stress you out and keep you from having a good time. You're welcome for that analogy. Kind of proud. Tink. <laughs> um, ideas. These colors are by Art Tree. They sent us these um, colors today. I believe they're out of Arts Australia, and. We said we'd review them, so that's what we are doing. We don't sell them. Um, I can send you to Art Tree Creations website, so but that's about it. I think that should be a different color because I don't want, because that is specifically to test selling. And if you say that these sell a lot anyways, I don't want that to get mixed into what this test is. Do you want a small square? No, because none of them are prepped. Wow. Well, then go for it. I think I'm just going to do a... Do a puddle pour. I'm going to do it right in the center. Thank you, Eva. I like the piece from last night, too. Beyond, you don't need no sugar, mama. Just do the work, be a good person, and good things will happen. Tandy Moo is in his little cubby hole under the desk, chilling. Lou says, I used to be so nervous until I started watching you guys. Heat gun rains in my house now. That is true.
Laura says, hi, y'all. I watch all the time. Very impressed. First time I'm able to watch live. I received some samples from Torganog. Can't wait to try them. Congratulations. It seems like the people that actually receive samples is about half and half. Laura says, E's young enough to be my daughter. Jeff, nah, not so much. <laughs> Melba, the analogy is true. Very real. And here I was thinking you found some colors from the U.S. Kelly, nobody does these colors in the U.S. However, since we're about to distribute, it's kind of like having U.S. colors. Way easy. Easy with the cell popping. Look, it's like the Mayron. I like the color of Mayron better. Well, yeah, this is, this is called... Uh, What is that? This is called uh, Rich Gold. Andrew? Three, four tilts. One. Andrew said, I want to share something with everyone. I bought 32 ounces of Art Resident Hobby Lobby today for $29. For everyone who can't math, that's one sixteen per gallon. That's bananas. Also, not every Hobby Lobby is honoring the discount coupons, but you can sneak it in online. Uh, I'm just asking for the, that's what she said. Daphne, I just haven't checked the, um, Facebook messages today, but I definitely will. That's a great place to send us your work. Beyonce says I'm probably young enough to be most of your guys' daughter or even granddaughter, LOL at Laura Taylor. I already called that slot, Beyond. You can't take, can't take my people. Also, Laura's not trying to be a sugar mama. She's just being helpful. Um, Teresa likes the gold and it is from Art Tree Creations. It's called Rich Gold. It's not bad. It's powdery. And it, I mean, it does great stuff. I guarantee the reason why that does that is because of the paint. I guarantee it. The paint that I used to prep this. What paint was it? It's uh, the house paint. Oh. Do cheap acrylic paints work to tighten canvases? Um, beyond it, my, the key is because canvases are basically cotton and cotton will shrink, you have to wet it and ultimately painting it does that and then hit it with heat to tighten <laughs> it up. So. You have to wet it to tighten it? B! That, that looks interesting. Judy's like, there's the grandson I never had, and I never will have. <laughs> Hi, but Trudy. Was the daughter, but the son. Beyond it works best that process on the thicker canvases, like the gallery wrap, the heavy duty ones. Are all the tweezers? I don't know where they are from the other day. You couldn't find them yesterday, right? That gold just takes over, like it's all the way over. Christy, I don't um, sell these colors. These are from Art Tree Creations. You'll have to get them sent over to the States from Australia. I will be distributing for Color Obsession and Artisu next month. Andrew, I bet you got an amazing haul. Yeah, this, this gold is really weird. Mm hmm I 
Agree, Linda. Wet and heat. Hmm, says Sheila. Idea says wetting it helps if it's more already, it helps more if it's already tight. You guys, this is not ATD after dark yet. We're only 45 minutes in. Lynn says, art classes can be very expensive and you share all this with us, so I want to contribute when I can. We appreciate it. Yes, Andrea. I know, Cindy, the red definitely just sank. Lisa, um, unless you're doing... That's going to end up being a base... Or I feel like unless you're doing um, like a geode or a textured multimedia piece I don't know how you would use the color granules or the wood chips hi Karen I hope you feel better yeah Daphne Mayron is not spray paint that is a body paint powder I'm not I'm not too proud of this Normally gold, you know, gives you that oomph, but I'm not, I'm not into it. Not into it either. It's such a really weird. I know, right, Tandy? And this is a white background, so this Hi, should Roxanne. really stand out. Yeah. I know. Definitely didn't. Hi, Gail. Can I just scrape it off and see what it looks like underneath? No. Put it in the trash if you do that. I, I wanted to leave it on, see what this paper does. Okay. Because it's such, it's such a bigger space than the wax paper. Yeah. And it'll all come up at once. Go for it. Because, like, you can't even see any of the... Nope. Whatever that is. It's different. That's semi fun. It's more fun than it was earlier. Do y'all ever do use a hair dryer for this? We have. But the airflow is a little too intense sometimes. That's very sweet of you, Andrea.
is definitely, definitely different. Very thin on the outside, very thin. Mm -hmm. That's not a bad thing. Oh, uh, but inch. Did we take down that packet? The, uh, I think I just put way too much gold. Gold typically takes to, over. This is definitely going to have to be a geo, so let's do this. Are you going to let me geode it? Hey, Ron. Uh oh, I'm gonna get, I know what I'm going to get over this, guys. B that looks a little bit Jaina y. Jaina, Jaina. Gina the geode. <laughs> Gina geode. All right. Tink. I actually like it better now because all the bright colors show up. Thank you, Zachy. Megan says I can smell it now. Girl. What that said. It's all pink in the middle. It is. Megan's going to be up here to um, moderate for us on Sunday so that we can paint together. B? I think you just busted a light. Is that what mm -hmm. I just heard? Yep. Maybe you can sell it to an OBGYN. Mm -hmm. Like, that's a brand new light bulb. I know. And it's on a surge protector. It's weird. Isn't that the it's bulb that came with it? Let's just put this all down. I don't want to use this bulb anymore. This is true ideas. Ooh, good one. Is it my turn? Can it be my turn? Cool. It's going to be mine. I get two crap boards, and she's like, here, let me have it. How's everybody doing on a Friday night? I don't know if you're down here, up here. In and around the here. Um, oh, there you go. Orange? She asked me to do an orange and purple oh, and one other Auburn? color pour. Huh? Are you gonna get set on fire? First of all, Auburn is orange purple. and blue. Oh. Clemson, no, yeah, Clemson, which are also tigers. Tink. All right, Judy, are you in here? I have a question. Can, do I have to like pour with resin or does it have to just be in it? Like, can this be the orange included or do do you oh my god y'all go he's it? painting a demon i'm just spreading it out it's what i was splitting it wide no look it's two eyes and a creepy smiley mouth like from over here it's creepy i don't like it and filigree Andrew said, uh, what is Jeff doing? Is he possessed? Possibly, yes. 
He's arting all so over the I place. Got, I got some freezer paper. And I'm going to see what, uh, how this skin dries. If we can peel it off and et cetera. Et cetera. Evil gold dolphin. Ah, okay, good. Well, I went ahead and pulled this color obsession that's like almost an exact match, so. Ooh, that's pretty. Sweet pea, be safe in the there storm. Thanks, me. Switch. That's the base head. Uh -huh. How's that lighting? It looks kind of dark in here, guys. Hey, Lillian, thank you very much. Nine, nine, and nine. <clears throat> it looks pretty dark. Well, it looks better. And it's not even on me. Like. Nobody's even looking at me. It's got that homeless left on me. Listen, I brought homeless sheep like nobody's business. Nobody's match. Oh, the, the hair is there. The plus side is my hair's clean. So that's cool. I want to do a fun pour. You can do a fun pour, but I've got to do this one. It's an assignment from Judy, and that, that like, trumps pretty much everything. All right. It's Friday night. We only got 160 people. Where's everybody at? Are they out partying? Probably. This is a poor people's party. It's on. So the break is down. Down? The down, the down, down, down. All right, we're zoomed in. Yes. All right, I'm going to be the one trying system three. I am going to These are my colors. Hi, Cujo. Y'all, I have, who do I have? What's those people? Maybe there's just too much. Too much awesome in one room. Oh no, Karen. Karen, yep, in there. Is Karen okay? Children at home. Rusty, let us know how that goes. I, I like that. Do we have Gold Digger and Stardust from Lorez? We don't have Gold Thanks, Digger. Thanks, Patty. One ninety nine. You are into our giveaway. What is it, Patty? And then who just gave the nine ninety nine? Patty just gave. I'm gonna. I look that. You don't have to write those down. I oh. That up. Oh, okay. I just write down who bought something so that. No, no, my phone memory's not full. I did go clear it though that day that I saw that comment. Oh, thanks, Lori. Um, Muhatake <laughs> gave four ninety nine. Thank you, Lori. You are also entered into. No, not Lori. She's saying somebody gave four ninety nine. Thanks, Rusty. 
Linda's like, this is my Friday night, ATD after dark. Woohoo! Earlier, people were like, this little oh. tink tink. I don't even know what that is. What is that? Support live music. Oh, Shiner Beers. That beer is made here in Texas. Yeah. Except for I am drinking. Not that. Modelo. <laughs> Ma T. Ma T. That's how you say that. Thank you. Somebody don't hit that. <laughs> Something is way out of line. Somebody didn't hit that thumbs up on the way to the room. Please go back, hit that button. Thanks, Judy. I love when Judy calls people If the out odor on from the chemicals you work with ever gets to you guys, since you both live and work in the same space. Um, well, we do, if, if it's something harsh, like spray paint, um, we have uh, ventilation, we have windows and fans, and we have respirators. The only bad reaction you have um, is Ron Jackson, he says, do you, know, do you know what interference paint powder is? We have stacks of it. We, we do, but we don't know exactly what it does. It looks like... It just shines other colors. Is that what it is? Okay. I guess it shines other colors. Like, the shimmer is a color. That's what it does. Instead of, like, a gold <laughs> shimmer, it's, like, a green shimmer. Paulina said, how, how long is ATD after dark? Have to stop watching for a bit. Hubby broke something. That's what I say when I want her to come in the bedroom. When did this get broke? It just makes a shattering sound and then I have to come in there. You guys, I'm so excited. We have almost all of our materials for our classroom in. I think we're missing like two things. Thanks, Jody. Iridescent. Well, it looks like you're pretty bad spelling names. <laughs> Beyond. <laughs> she said, Jeff is really bad with A-N mains. A-N <laughs> mains. feel like that would be too. <gasps> but we haven't used this one yet. What is it? This is Amethyst. Put it. Obsession. Hold on. Let's see, yeah, color obsession. All right. Red, blue, gold, violet, aqua, and orange. Nope. Green? Nope. Are you telling somebody some other colors, Judy? <laughs> Do we have to Thanks, one? Anna. Keisha. What's up, Keisha? It's, uh... What is that? Keisha, your package is going out tomorrow. I sent you an email as well. Get it? Hi, Wondering Art. No. What? Did you get this? Yeah. Put it back. Oh, she's listing interference colors. All right. All good. What is the purpose of using a base color on the canvas? Lori Tromboni. Um, it's just a color that won't, <clears throat> that won't get mixed in with the other colors. And sometimes if it sells or you get a negative space, then you, you get a solid color all the way around your canvas. So if it does like uh, you know, go over the edge and it doesn't get covered all the way. It's still a, a cohesive color around the entire canvas. 
cohesive. Look it up. <laughs> Tell E that your range and blue look awesome together. Probably your orange. Your orange. Ah. Oh, the shirt, the yum shirt. Tromboni. All right, calm down, Beyond. Beyond, shouldn't you be at a graduation party? <laughs> it's Friday. There's all kinds of graduation parties. Um, Linda, I can see now with my uh, new glasses. Thanks to Judy. Thanks, Judy. Thank you. <laughs> Karen. Low, Jeff, low. Feeling a little frisky tonight, Friday night. Bye, 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 bye. Thank you. Jeff, ask E if my order is coming, please. Okay. France. Yes. Yes. It's a solid yes. I will send you your tracking number tomorrow. I Y'all, my life has been eight shades of crazy since we started doing the sticks. Friends, I really appreciate you being so lenient. Um, we added some posters into your package for you. Just bonus stuff for being so sweet and patient. Samantha, that's a, I believe that's plum. No. Said, okay, I might, I may need that purple. What is that? Amethyst. How many? Amethyst. 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 By, um, and I'm trying a system three that have gotten all kinds of crazy colors. That's right, Teresa. I don't know what percentages to use with this because I didn't read it. Oh, no more than 10%. Mm -hmm. I probably just blew that all the way out of the water, but... Thanks, France. Ron Jackson, I just ordered that white paste. Hope you use my link. Okay. I made orange just in case, but basically what I want to do is make a big version of what melted off of this canvas. Robin, see, you didn't miss too much of nothing. Just mixing some colors. Color. I think she's using uh, uh, Color Obsession and a new white. Yes, by System 3. System 3 white. I'm about ready to take it, get, a, get another beer and maybe get some of that Fireball. Who wants a shot of Fireball tonight? You know, the last time we did a shot of Fireball, who was it that brought that to our attention? <laughs> yeah. That was like, I don't Karen know. G says system three question mark. Um, High passion. Three is an epoxy pigment paste that I've read does pretty amazing cellular things. And I haven't tried it yet, but I've been asked about it. So we went ahead and we bought some. This was not sent to us. Um, we're going to try it out for you guys. Like, right. <laughs> Can I wait? What? Are you. I'm just getting a beer. Oh, I didn't know if you were doing the shot thing, so I wasn't going to, like, mess up before because I didn't have a shot. Anybody else want that? I got some fire on my hand. Oh, then I'll wait. Are you still using that, that clear that I use? I mean, I laid some of it down. You're just like playing on the edge, don't you, babe? I live on the edge! So I'm just going to heat this up some because I wanted to do amazing things. <laughs> I'm scared. I can't open it. See, it has to go before it. I'm just going to mess up it. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> I'm gonna cover up until she gets done. Whoosh. That's gonna be interesting. Hey, happy owl. I feel like I should have made a gold. Whoops. Sorry, guys, gals. Thanks, Kelly. I got you. Right here. Tink. Tink. For the Sippy Fund and celebrating Friday night. Rod, $24.99. What? What? Now we have to take a shot for Rod's honor. All right. Rod, you get some of this. I don't want to hear any lip. <laughs> the white is gone. Oh no, two rods. He said, I University of Illinois colors. Oh, Rod Cryo? Is that how you say that? Cryo? C R I L E? Sounds like it. <laughs> Rod, Rod Line says, Oh no, two rods. <laughs> Babe, don't do that. Now it's just gonna go through your shirt and stick and get on you. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. She just dipped it in her, she just dipped her shirt in. Mm -hmm. Dipped it in it, the whole dip dip. All right, I'm gonna take, cause this is gonna get, it's gonna get hot and I'm, watching you guys with my friends at the bar. <laughs> Thanks, Amanda. So is that even part of the drinking game? Keisha, tell E War Eagle for me. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Anna, Anna says, Jeff, can I hire you to prep my ladder board frames? Sure. What is that? Prepping is not as fun as pouring and taking me way too long to prep. I know we're going to, we're going to do some aprons. We'll get some next week um, and test them out and see what we like best and show you guys what, what, uh, what you guys like best. All children go to bed now. Happy owl. <laughs> Sounds like happy owls ready to <laughs> get ATD after dark on us over here. Broncos poor? Mm. Could be. Ideas dealers? What? I think ideas is colorblind. Here it goes. I'm taking this. Sorry. Oh, she did it. Uh -uh. <laughs> oh. What did Rod say? All I hear is laughing at Ron. Where's Ron at? Uh -uh. Ask Erica, isn't Alabama the school you go to if you can't get into Auburn? <laughs> I'm going to get beat for laughing at that, Rod. Roll okay. Tide. And if I don't say that, then I get beat, too. That's true. You will. Auburn is a vocational school. Is it rum? Uh, no. Robin C., it's Fireball. It's a cinnamon whiskey, whiskey basically. 
I don't know, Lydia, we should try to put some fireball in there. <laughs> fireball pour? Is it weird that all I do my pours in a cardboard box? Oh, yeah, okay. In a, are you homeless, Bion? <laughs> Uh, do you live in a two-story cardboard box, Bion? No, hate to all the homeless people out there that may be watching on their smartphones. No, well, gets. Does it look weird with that orange blowing into that? Passion Lotus, five dollars. Bing, 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 bing. Yes, Thank you. Hey, we're here to help everybody learn. We love it. We love it. We love it. Does that look weird? Let's see here. Let's get him up close here. That little waterfall on the backside looks good. All about the backside. E, the same face I made after my tequila shot Thursday night. Laura Taylor. I was like, that has to be Laura. She plays this Mexican drinking game. It's like Uno and Domino's put together. What happened to the purple? It's in there. It's in there. It's just, it's very dark. That Judy me out That's what she said. Andrea Moore, $2. Boing, 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 boing. I'm pretty sure that little fireball cost $2. So thanks. But we got it in Austin. <laughs> How funny was I when I was live in Austin? I was at a certain club, I think. I think you were at dinner. Oh, that's right. I don't think you had hit the certain club yet. Okay. This Area 2222. Hey, guys, did I miss much? Uh, just a little bit. Me messing up two canvases. <laughs> and now uh, Erica is doing a pour that Judy asked her to do the colors for. See, I need you to see this. This is why we like to paint the base of our canvases a color. Because that is a divot, I'm pretty sure. But it doesn't look like it because the bottom is not white. Make sense? Okay, cool. What? Start over. <laughs> Beyond, you said that you do your pours in a cardboard box and ask if you were homeless. And obviously I was just kidding. Sweet. Hey Jeff, can you wish my son Hunter a happy birthday? Hunter is big 11 today. All right. Happy birthday, Hunter. He's like, it takes more than this to say how old I am. Plus one more. Happy birthday, Hunter. I'm this many today. Sorry if I'm yelling, guys. I have my headphone in. <laughs> Just one. B, did you hear what I was saying about that pit? Or nip? A pit? This is a pit. It's and like it, it would look shitty if it wasn't orange on the bottom. Ah. Because we painted the base a color, it's almost hard to even see that it's there. This right there is a pit. And you can't really tell. Were you at the Yellow Rose? Unfortunately, Megan, I was. <laughs> Megan, were you there? We made a progress report on how he acted. Night, Karen.
He is so loving it. Feel better, Karen. Thanks, Nora. She's going to put some spray paint gold in there now. Let me take you out of here so you can see what she's doing. It's going to be a little shaky because I've, I've got it zoomed in. But... I can't go very far because she's charging her phone. Uh oh, she's going... She's going... Uh, I would go just, I would go up like you did all these. Just go, just stay uniform. That would look actually good. Or not. <laughs> I was like, up. Like, is this not it's, the up? Yeah, but you're going this way. I'm just saying up. Oh. You, it's your painting. I don't, I'm sorry. I should have not said anything. They're going to get on to you. It's hard to see that gold because there's no light behind you. Oh, you can see it a little better now, but now there's a big reflection. <laughs> you see that gold, guys? Look at that. This is my favorite part of it. <laughs> yes, Jeff, let her art. I'm trying to, Trudy. Trudy said amazing. Thank you, Trudy. Oh, she's filling that fireball. <laughs> I'm gonna name this something goddessy so that I can put it in that show we have coming up. Yes, Kelly. That's the uh, that's the new white. I'm gonna. I'm about to do something. I'm gonna. I'm about to do another piece so that I can more showcase the white. More this is, showcase. Yeah, more showcasing. This is my favorite part of this pour. Like th this. Yeah, those cells are pretty crazy. B, will you lift up the flap? Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go lift up the flap while she uh, puts her pores in it. And I while I'm doing that, there's some info for you kids in the, the UK and Canada and Australia and the U.S., God, I'm listening to old school Metallica. Move, go My again. goodness. Move came out to say hi. He's been there. He's been there since I got my beer. Hi, Moo. Come here. You want to say hi? We went to FedEx today and people love seeing Moo's. Feel right adding an orange to this 
color because that would definitely be Aubrey. Also, I feel like I paid enough money to Alabama to have to stay roll tight at this juncture. Thanks, Judy Granger. Not our Judy? Mm, she said great poor. Is this art tree? No, it's um, color obsession. Color obsession. She's using color obsession right now, guys. I didn't use art tree. Thanks, Robin. I love your moo. You can't not love the moo. Oh, babe. Ooh. No, it was too much. <laughs> she went. She went crazy with that. Yeah, but now that, that'll show up a lot better, that, that purple. Put some heat in there. Make it thin. All right. I'm going to. I'm going to. The CEO, Laura, does not want us to talk about... Judy, what is that talking about? What she said? Judy Granger, the CEO Laura does not want us to talk about. Uh, it was Fireball. <laughs> oh, look at that. Babe, you got those blows from me, didn't you? The way the ins and the outs. You taught me how to in and out blows. Mm hmm. Happy owl. Stop, Jeff. Let her art. I'm putting you in timeout. All right, I'll stop reading. Oh, thanks, France. Um, the piece you just finished, babe? What? The piece you just finished, how much? That was on a 125 size? Uh, 125, whoever asked. All right, y'all. Team Fireball. Look at that. We just got to set that on the one that's not crooked. I know. Y'all. Y'all. I love it. <laughs> My hair's falling down. B, look how amazing. Can you see the depth in this or no or yes? If you receive those pigments, try them. Oh my God, that's gorgeous. I love the technique so much. Nice color. Keep it flat tonight, E. Right. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, buddy. That's super pretty. Right? Jeff, is that blue canvas spray painted or house? It's spray painted. It's sugar. It's sugar spray paint. And apparently now. Holy moly. Um, Hobby Lobby carries sugar. Yeah, I sent you that. I know, I'm telling you. Hobby Lobby carries sugar um, and Ilac or okay. Iron Lac. Ooh, I thought it was sugar. It's not. It's 94. Oh, it's not. It's 94. There you go. That is by Montana. Her color is Azul. This little piece here, what do you think? She, she's probably gonna wanna keep that piece, so we'll do 75 if anybody's interested in that little guy right there, this little guy. I love it, can you even see the depth in it? Can you even see from there? You can. Like, look in this part and under that part. That is beautiful to me. 
I love this like clamshell looking situation right here. Also, I have kale left over, so I'm probably going to grab another candle. You're moving it. All right. Oh, I love this little guy. The last time I said that, it melted. Uh, Wondering Art, it turned out pretty fun. It sold <laughs> right, it sold right when we, uh, She would have bought it last night. She was the one that asked you about the price for it. Okay, I'm going to put this down. It moved a lot. Let's see if we can do this. We'll move you this way. Tilt you up. Well, that's fun, huh? It looks really awesome. Like when you put it up to the uh, the window, like the sunlight, it'll it'll project off all these colors onto the wall. So it's like stained glass. Oh, she just went and spray painted purple. Is the selling like that because of the new white? Um, to be honest, those colors sell like that anyways. This is the thing, people. Resin makes everything sell. Lies. Acrylic paints. It, it still makes it sell a little bit, but I, I, I honestly think that. that's why. You, you're not going to put water in, in these paints and they're going to sell. Resin makes everything sell, just not as much as other stuff. I know. It that still sells. That did not sell right there. Okay, except for shitty craft paint. Right. Yes, I agree with you on all of the accounts. Shitty craft paint's not going to do it. And the thinner, the thinner that you get your, your resin with pigments or paints or whatever in it, that's when it starts to sell up. Love me when I'm grown. You singing to the congregation? That I could not tell my pants. There's so many like orange and purple fans in here. If this one doesn't sell, I don't even know what it's gonna look like. But I'm gonna say you guys are fair weather fans. You probably need to relay that to them. They probably need to me. Love nothing. So love me when I'm gone. What? Sorry. I said, since purple and orange is colors that are like people's... Edward song. says, do you like the silicone things better than push pins? Um, well, yeah, when you're... Uh, when there's so much... The excess stuff down here, the push pins tend to slide around on that. Um, and it just kind of... It's kind of irritating. Um, and this, that holds really well, like, you know, and the paint drops off the side. Uh, the only thing is when you put it in the, the pan thing that we have, the, the pan rack, it sticks to the entire pan. So you have to wait a full, like <laughs> 24 hours to take it off there. Cause it sticks. The, uh, the art resin takes a lot longer to dry. So it's difficult to take that off of there with the push pins it barely sticks and it, you know, keeps it off of it. The only thing, bad thing about the push pins 
is you have the drips on the bottom and then you have to sand them. Unless you take care of it and baby it and you know wipe it with a, uh, a stick to wipe all the drips off the bottom. Mr. Internet, uh-oh. I always want to see these trolls. I did. <laughs> I guess we have a troll. I don't advise that. Grrr. If you guys have not done my coasters, I will take a $75 painting in instead and pay the difference. This one? Rusty K. Yeah, we have the... I have her order over there. We haven't. It's the order for the purple teal. The purple teal and something coasters. Rusty, would you want the same colors? Would you want the same colors, Rusty? Will you do a... Hold on a second here, Kelly Green. I think they're all uh, color obsession except for the white. Rusty said yes. Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, babe, will you turn those so we can see the name? Of course. Hold on. Let me go back. Whoa. What is that? Some psychedelic. Can you guys see that? Amethyst, turquoise, and I can't see the name of it. It's not, it's not on the front of it, or is it? No, oh. Earthquake, earthquake, earthquake. Orange crush. Orange crush. I'm kind of digging it. Whoops. Man, I am just being bad cameraman tonight. What do you guys think? Mm hmm. For the colors, I was challenged. I think I did a good job. Does Color Obsession do metallics or pearlescent colors? They do do metallics. They do do pearlescents. They do not at the moment do golds and silvers right now, but they're going to. Also, love it. Guys, really love the colors. Love the colors. They're wild, interesting. As they're popping up cells just as we're talking right now. Hi, Amanda's daughter. Hi, Amanda's <laughs> daughter. Love the contrast. Like, I wish you guys were here to see how... I'm gonna leave that alone. How deep it is? Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna unplug you. Okay. Man, your phone, like, shakes for everything. Does it not have a stabilization on it? Got a pit? Nope. Oh. I love how this teal broke up. That looks fun. That middle part right there? Mm-hmm. happy with it. And if you guys are real Clemson and Laker fans or whatever, then you would love it too. Slash want to buy it. <laughs> you basically don't love your team. You leave 
Thanks, blue-eyed bombshell. Momshell? Is that what that said? <laughs> How much is this one? Um, it's 50 Uh, who said that? Amanda, it's $50. No, that's what, that one's only 50 Ann. You're welcome, Trudy. 50, so. All right. We're going to have to use this system three with like just it and like a blue ink, something that doesn't sell up really well. Let's Actually. use it with a black. Huh? Let's do a black. You want to do another four? Yeah, let's do a black. Do you have a canvas press? I have these. Okay. Or should we not? It's Friday. Okay. Should we do it on? Oh, let's do half and half. We'll do the infamous half and half. All right, hold on. Let me get the people to you. Should there be a full moon tonight? I don't know. I think so. What up, you guys? I'm back. Good night, Lou. It is pour the fireball in the resin. Y'all, that's crazy. Was there a troll in there, guys? Is he a troll? Um, I don't know. Got. Situation. <laughs> Situation over here. Um, Amanda said sold. So let me write that down. Amanda L E I G H T O. Okay. Last, finding that the PayPal connection is not getting to you. Somebody asked about the other one too. Christy, it's Thornton at artisttilldeath.com. Amanda, got your payment. Let me write that down. I'm kind of digging that last one. Do you use any services other than PayPal? I also do Venmo. Jody Granger. I know I sent them to you, Jody, but I will double check that. Let me write that down. G R A N G. check um jody i will oh the painting with all the pits in it yes hi moo what are you doing are you being mooey you know what okay so this is let me turn all the lights on these are our reject pours that we're trying to figure out what to do. The moon that we scraped off and then the pits. And they're textured pits like, I don't know, you're not gonna be able to see them. Oh yeah, you can see them. We definitely need to figure out what's up with that. 
But that's how it turned out. We're not sure if we're going to paint over it. Jeff said if someone wanted it, he would sell it for $250 instead of the $650 that that size goes for. But the moon. And that one. Y'all, here's all of our canvases. That's like a bucket list to me. To sell to a blind man. Sell a piece of artwork to a blind man. Your bucket list is to sell a piece of artwork to a blind man? Well, to a blind individual. A seeing impaired individual. Visually impaired because individual? somebody described it, and then I had to explain it to him, he says, I'll buy it. I think that would be incredibly amazing. Incredibly incredible? Yeah. All the incredibleness. Friday night, tink, tink. Um. No. Um. Thank you. Wait till you guys see our new stickers. Oh, yeah. Tink. Amanda, was it through PayPal? How much for the dragon, please? Lars wants to know. Huh? Oh, what do we say for that every time? <laughs> I think. Uh, Martha, I got three, your. Four, no, three seventy-five for it. Three seventy-five for the diptych. Yeah. All right. I think I can just pour in here. That'd be fine. Yeah, that's the one I just did. We'll try. We're just going to do black and white, right? That's it. Maybe some gold? No. I wouldn't do this with any other resin. <laughs> no. Amanda, $50. Amanda, $10. Yes, Amanda, I got your payment for the coasters and for the painting. Um, yeah, Trudy, we used an art spray and it ended up pitting, but it didn't smell like there was alcohol in it. And then like the ingredient list didn't say anything silicone-y, so I'm not sure why it did that, but... Mm. silicone -y? Yeah, it's a thing. It's like silicone Island. <laughs> kind of, yeah. Khaleesi said yes to gold. That thing to the left of Jeff's, Jeff's head is pretty. What's on it? That or that? Can't, trace of color, can you just use the big popsicle one over there? Can you tell me what colors? Jody, I am not sure. <sighs> Carrie Floyd says, okay, Jeff, show her who's boss. <laughs> Just because I ace every one of my pours ever doesn't mean that it has to be competition. Well, I've, I've been wanting to do just black and white. Do you have a black? No. Do you know which black you would prefer? Just a black. Amanda, yes. Also, the $27, I do see that as well. Beyond, give us $2. That means a lot to me because I know that you're, like, scraping for cash. I I, I, B. <laughs> she Thank just... You very much. Beyond probably just pours in a cardboard box to, like, protect from all I the... I understand out what she meant. I know what that means. I know. I was Never just describing it for the other people. Was. Right. Because she lives with her mom and parents, and she doesn't want her mom to know that... She arts all the time. By the way, I think you should continue to art all the time and fulfill your dream of being an artist. If that's what you choose to do, do it 
Thank you, Anne. Is Jeff going to use that new white and those color obsession? No, we're just using, oh, just That's awesome, Kelly. You have a black? I have black truffle. Let's try to use that. There might be a different black on the air. So I was going to tell you guys, um, if you want to do like a fade like this, and you don't want it to, if you have just a, a normal tip on your spray can. Mm, uh, the tip. If you, you know, if you want to do a fade, black to white, paint, start with black. We'll show you here. And take it kind of at an angle and just spray. Spray here, spray, 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 and just kind of mist it, mist it, mist it. You'll, you'll get some black over spray over here. Don't worry about that. Then you turn it around. Take white and spray it in that direction as well. I'll only spray when you hit the canvas. Don't sit here and press down and spray it like this because it'll go everywhere. Just spray it, spray it, and just do it kind of low so that you're not getting a bunch of overspray to get over here. That's how I did this right here. That's if you wanted to know. <laughs> Sharon. Because that's what I'm listening to right now. Erica, you're naughty. This is true. Samantha well said. That's what, that's what song's on right now, if you guys don't even know. Runaway? Yeah. If you guys want to listen to some awesome music, Ed, Ed Sharon, he'll put you in the mood to dance, to art, to other stuff, to other stuff. <laughs> and well, then when you see him, you're like, there is not, that's not him. <laughs> I know. What is his name? Ron Greasley. What's the redhead from Harry Potter? Ronald Weasley. What was the name of that special tip that you get for spray paint? Did you tell them what kind of tip is best? No, I just said if you have just a, a regular tip, like the tip that comes on the, the spray paint, um, that would be the easiest way because you have no control with that. It's just like... I will, Philly Phil. What, what is the name of this yellow one? Uh, it, it was a... It was called a German Thin back in the day, but it was gray. That's... That's probably the most universal, very, like a very nice, controlled, thin line. You can get a, a line about that, about that thin. If you're fast, you know, you do it fast and the paint is shaken up and you, have, and you use Montana paint. Did you shake this up or do I need to shake it up? Oh, that one. Just painting to the left of his head beside Ede's geode, like a man's face half hidden by hair, freaking me out. I know he looks like he's puffing out some smoke too, right? That's our Easter egg Marley. Am I like not doing this right? Think of it like a medicine jar, just push down and twist. It just keeps clicking. I just took it off too. Like this. Give it some muscle, babe. It just keeps clicking. Am I doing it the wrong way? You're gonna help me. I'm just gonna go everywhere. Sorry. I don't know. I didn't even, I didn't tighten it or anything. You're down and turn. That's what we're doing. Hey, I don't know what you did. You may have to just pry it off. Just too much of that muscle. See, I don't know.
Levels, 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 levels. That's weird. I don't know why I would do that. Don't let it ever stop you, Jackie. I don't get it. That's weird, man. Y'all, this child-proof cap has... Um, Giving us way. a we're gonna get it off one way or another. B I guess it is after dark. Maybe not. Yeah, it's coming off. Oh. I'm scared. Well, at least it'll be on the camera if it explodes in my face. Oh, that's happened. Never mind. <laughs> oh, the top is coming off, but the little protection cap isn't. It's oh, ATD wow. proof. I just hit 8760 subs. Congratulations, Christina. You're coming in hot behind us. Are all your small lip pieces on your website? Um, kind of. You can order like a custom one. Oh my gosh. You pick the size and then you pick the colors. This is kind of ridiculous. <laughs> nah. -uh. This should come off now. Give me some pliers. There's some down there. Yeah. You're gonna need another shot after this. Surrender. Get another paint. Where we're supposed to be testing this particular paint. Bam. Can't keep us out, bitches. Sweet Bliss said this is too funny. Hi, Tanya. It's Friday. And then he walks off. Where's the crowbar? We need the jaws of life over here. Over here. What, what black did we get? Um, I pulled out... Blue I pulled out Blue Lagoon because it's pretty color and we haven't used it yet. And also, I pulled out Black Truffle because you said black. We're gonna definitely have to get more. I made way too much revenue. Looks like we're going late tonight, kids. Our session is pretty transparent, right? Some of them. Some of them. You guys, we got in a battle the other day because this person sent Jeff a text message and was like, yo. No. What? Are you just bringing that up to bring it up? No, I thought I would share it because you were saying. Because no, I'm sure people saw it and everybody's going to be like, Jeff, you were rude. <laughs> All right, we'll drop it. Formerly Rod Line. When did you change your name to the artist formerly known as Rod Line? Let me tell you a little story about the artist formerly known as that little part. I was a, you know, a decent airbrush artist. Decent. Decent. It was when I was in my... You know, I was selling a lot of artwork, 
Um, and I was like, ooh, that's when Prince changed his name, Prince, artist formerly known as Prince. I had business cards made that said, the artist formerly known as Starby. And as you can imagine, I did not get one sale. I didn't sell any paintings, no commissions, no car hoods, nothing for probably a month and a half. So I threw all those cards away. <laughs> not good. Not good to be cocky. Not good. I'm logging in right now to list that system three to my Amazon affiliate storefront. And that is in the link below. How should we do this? Is this the truffle? Uh, yeah. This should be fun. I didn't see here. So. Oh, let's do this. Okay, it's in the influencer list. Also, Megan says, Jeff, you are not rude. See, I don't want to bring that up, guys. I know you don't. Also, everybody um, likes your story from your artist formerly known as Starving. Shy says, those, Jeff, that's fucking funny. It was one of those very humbling, oh yeah? Well, how about this? <laughs> the, uh, the art uh, karma gods were like, here, we're going to go ahead and do this for you. <laughs> Amanda wants to know if you know a tattoo artist named Brian Fuentes. Where does he uh, work at? Or does he have his own shop? Jody, System 3 is just a white epoxy paste, but people like swear by it for sales, and so I decided I was going to give it a shot. I purchased some, and we're trying it live here tonight for y'all. We're going extra long tonight, kids, for you guys, for Friday night. Trudy, yes. Heat gun does get rid of the tiny bubbles that form in resin. What's the smallest size you would suggest for a geode? I wouldn't go smaller than a 12 by 12. It gets really convoluted. Yeah, you want, you want more open, uh, you know, big spaces where you can see the colors, you can see the transitions, you know, you can see the little lines. That's what I noticed in yours. Like, she does... Uh, she's just really good with color, so she could probably do a small one, but... Here's a sweet bee. To start bee. off, I would, I would definitely go smaller, or bigger. Yeah. But not big. Big, but not big. In between big and not big. Very definitive. What do you think about the white? Um, so far, I haven't noticed anything different with it versus the... Lorez, Artisu, and Color Obsession White. But Jeff's going to use more of it in this piece so that I can get more of a read on it. Happy y'all, I ordered it from Amazon. I've included it in my link in the description box below this video. It's already there. If you click on the Amazon link, it'll take you to all the things I use regularly, including this. The this night, Paulina. Beyond sounds like you need to take a nap. <laughs> night, Natalie. I 
I know Jeff knows most of the bigger name Maybe. tattoo artists out here, but he may know that person, but he just can't think of them off the top of his head. Where are all our blue cups at? Ron, I saw that they had a black paste as well, but I, I didn't invest in any of those. My resin pigment is like a 16 color pack of crayons. ATD super size 128 box with sharpener even. Did you hear that? <laughs> Formerly Rod's got jokes. Lars. Thank you so much. Sippy Sip and Erica and Jeff, so appreciated. We we have to cheers this donation we just got. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Lars. Lars. 50 big ones. Lovely. Thank you very much. Lynn, my amazing little sister is in the house. My hands are blue now, by the way. Looks like this. I'm going to zoom in. Oh, well then, I'm glad you're still here, Natalie. Moo, calm down. He's huffing and puffing at me. And now I'm listening to Pat Benatar. <laughs> Thank you, Trudy. Have a great evening, Simone. Judy says, just great. I give myself an Amazon intervention, and now you're doing Amazon Influencer. Judy, don't make my poor decisions influence your poor decisions. <laughs> I support your cold turkiness from Amazon. Cold turkey. And I will bring you some System 3 if you want to play with it. She'll bring you, she'll bring you some stuff if you want to play with it. Mm. Lynn says, I'm home this time. That means I can join in the sippy sippy. She's 21 now, so she can definitely like join in. Maybe 19, right? No, she just turned 21. Like 20 seconds ago. Hi, Kelly. Um, it's System 3, and I got it from Amazon. I have a link in the description box below here. You can use it to see all the things that I use regularly. And I included the System 3 just now, so you can um, check it out. Let's get a closer look at what we got going on over here. I know, Ann Lynn, she works a lot. Sippy sisters, it's true. Tink Tink Lynn. Agreed beyond. Jeff, that's real old school. It looks like a gnarly, like, crashing wave, but then that black. Oh. This one time we went to a beach, and I don't want to bring up, like, old <laughs> shit since my sister's in the room, but she got, like, beat up by a wave. It looked kind of like this one. My little sister is one of the most amazing little baby artists ever. I really like these because they have like that dark inside line. Just thin it out and you get cells like crazy guys and gals. Look at that. Trudy wants to know if we ever do art shows closer to Houston. Uh, we don't have any on deck right now, but we're open to travel for art shows. Send me a link to any that are coming up. I'd say that white sells. It definitely does. It's like a cell party. However, to be fair, 
Oh, B, I got you this. That's so shiny. But I don't know how much resin you'd have left over. Why is that so shiny? Is that so wet? Um, oh. it's a Rust-Oleum. Um, to be fair with this white, you guys, the other colors that we used were epoxy paste by Artisu that I, I am sure sell from experience. So, look at that. That's like a true phthalo blue, or as Anne Marie calls it, patello. Lynn said, thanks. Lynn, I know that was not your best day, but it was <laughs> definitely something for the memory really books. Bad, uh, coconut drink <laughs> from Nasty. What's her name from the from the lady that was selling us coconut drink? Nasty from... Nelly or something like that. Like, don't talk to me. Lynn said, "Should I recount how you guys constantly get hit on by the dealers and the pit bosses?" Sure. Jeff gets hit on by pit bosses all the time. Anna, it's not more paint than resin because you don't want to, you want to stick to about 10%. The key is to have an epoxy paste, which Color Obsession sells and System 3 as well. And Artisu and La Res, they all have epoxy paste. Put the clear down. Clear? Mm -hmm. For what? For a base. Like all over it? It's like not going to mix. Okay. You don't have oh, to. You did clear first? On all of my little square ones, I did clear first. Well, I wasn't gonna. Do you don't have to then. What you were gonna do. Oh. You don't, you wanna stick to about 10% and a penny so that you don't end up with like a marshmallow fluff consistency. Lars, we definitely did fireball tonight for sure, for sure. Wouldn't you, well, I think I'm about going to get another one. Mud yeah, Pie Girl more. wants to know how much for that last one. What was that? Uh, 10 by 10. 10 by 10, 125? Mud Pie Girl, that one was 125. All right, we're going to do this. Shai said it's his eyes. I, oh, and the arms. Eyes and the arms. Agreed. It's all about that base, about that base. No trouble. Y'all remember that song? Am I the only one? Okay, cool. It's fine. I can be the only one. I gotta get a sippy sippy. Lynn, did you ever, um, Lynn was going to do, um, some resin pours, but did you ever end up doing that? Beyond, um, Lynn doesn't sleep that much either. She works and she helps take care of our father who has. Late stage Parkinson's. She is very sweet to him. She's 21, but she spends a lot of time at home helping out with our dad. She's amazing. Night, Debbie. That looks great. I love how it's just subtly there. Blow this way, blow that way. 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 Blow this way, bl
this way, go that way. Let me unzoom it and just get in there. Ellen says, don't touch it. Looks fantastic. I love it. I love these like clamshell like looks. Blue-eyed mom shell, I'm pretty sure it's because of the fireball. Thanks, Fireball. Thanks, Fireball. <laughs> uh, happy Owl, I did see that, and those girls were bananas. It looks like an Indian elephant. Hmm, probably. It's still selling up. Lynn, Next time I get a batch of resin in, I'll send it to you. I don't have any small batches, but I really want you to try this art form because you're so good at art in general. Thanks, Keisha. Teresa says you need to trademark those Thornton flip blows. I've decided to dub those ribbon blows because they kind of like ribbon over each other. See, we got to get used to doing these long pours for my 24 hour pour. That's true, but I don't want it to cut in like at 30, 30 minutes in or whatever. Billy Phil says, with all these great, loving, generous people tonight donating, Jeff can finally get that mic he needs. Say it with your chest. What comedian was that? That was, uh, say it with your chest, Kevin Hart. Was that Kevin Hart? Wandering Art just ordered a lip print. Thank you. I'm so glad. I love that piece. What the fireball? You're a good egg, Lynn. I agree. I do not have any Jose. We got some tequila in there. I'm not doing tequila. We got to be at BFD tomorrow. Linda says, I'm going to have to give me some of that fireball. I like what it does. <laughs> Is that going to be a new thing? Is this going to be a fireball pour? Is when we just do magical things? Let's see it from this side. It's crazy how people like want cells so bad and then add all this crazy stuff into their like mediums. But really, if you just have a good paint, it'll do it for you. Hi, Angel Heart. We're actually doing one more pour, so you haven't missed that much. Whoa. That like this is paint. fireball, Natalie. Looks like this. Oh, we got more. It's a cinnamon whiskey. And apparently, some of you guys have noticed that we do our best pours when we take a shot of Fireball. If I had gloves on, I would move that into the safe zone for you. Hi, PJ. It's bigger. Look how smooth that is. Glass, be glass. All right, I'm gonna move it. I got it. The lid is up. I got it, Where's that gonna go? See? There you go. What's that? Can you do that tonight? Yeah. Just, I just did that. I can't know it. Okay. Um, All right. Modelo. This should be interesting here, please. We have no clear, so we can't put... Let's do this. Should we do...
it's like 90% All right, where am I at? So for that pour, we were using Black Truffle by Artisu. Like, what, Midnight, Stormy Blue, Midnight Blue, something by Artisu, and then System 3 White. Formerly Rod says, you get sales because you made a deal with the devil. That's true. Jackfire is also good. Very true, very true. Jamie says, that's the best pours because there's no overthinking. Agreed. Night, Leanne. It's funny because I've been painting like that. I've been literally like approaching my my fine artwork the way i just mess around and i end up really enjoying it doing better so because i'm not overthinking it and i'm not worrying about if it's going to come out right because of a certain technique i'm using i've, I've really been loving doing it and i think it's all because i'm using a paintbrush at first now instead of just airbrush Kelly says that base color is hot. True. System 3 is an epoxy pigment. PJ, I have it listed in the description box below this. Lynn, you definitely need to update your social media since you're going to be a famous artist. Be that's a very like art deco what you got going on right there. Hi, Ticey. What happened to the system? Three bottle. I, I couldn't get it open, so we decided we were going to use the Jaws of Life, and so then that happened. B, there's not a lot of resin in that gold, so be sparse. How much did that cost? I want to say like less than $20, more than $12 US. What's that? The System 3. I can't remember exactly what it cost, though. Tink, tink, everybody. Cheers to all poor people. Tink. I really love arting with all of you guys. Like being able to come on here and pour with you guys and all of you are interested in the same things that we are. It makes my whole heart happy. Same CJ. Megan said, get that fireball. It's going to warm up. Yeah, Shy, cast and craft is kind of expensive. Um, I have a bottle of it. I got it before I got all the other. Ooh, that's hot. We are family, Kelly. Idea said... I told Jeff the other day, arting with you guys has exploded my skill with resin. What? He did. I remember him saying that. Uh, 
Keisha, just because I hit my one year goal doesn't mean I'm gonna stop posting daily. I just want, I wanted to set a goal of posting every day just to set a goal for myself because I'm very goal driven. Um, but that doesn't mean I'm gonna stop. I have no intentions of stopping. Area 222 says, I see you guys more than I see my own family. PJ says, I raise my Pepsi. I raise my Pepsi to you fine folks. May the resin be with you all. Well, I guess the pink didn't really make a difference. Not if you don't put any clear down. You're not going to be able to see that. Right. Have you done any mermaid inspired pour yet? Um, not really, Lynn. I mean, I've done a lot of aquatic theme pours, so I guess that may count, but not really. Now here's where it gets fun. Watch, it's gonna go. What's it gonna do? Wah. <laughs> <laughs> so apparently shy is like a million miles away from a hobby lobby and andrea was like man shy that's crazy are you a hillbilly or just no hobby lobby stores in your area <laughs> Philly Phil asks, how many different styles of paint is there that people would use? Spray paint, acrylics, mica, et cetera. And is there a possible average cost per? There is not an average cost per, like off the top of my head because the prices vary so much. So I could, I could calculate a median cost with like a sober brain. I mean, right now is not the time or the place. Yeah, fireball's gonna get I, I got it for you, B. Look, it's all sweaty and the M word. <sighs> Did you almost do any sound? <sighs> but yeah, okay. So the paints that one would use in resin would be spray paint, mica metal tints epoxy paste watercolors acrylics can i just group it in to say no oils and even though people would you could use oil some people do like kiss rita kiss she uses oils and gets amazing results however the one time i did it my painting leaked all over my carpet true story actually happened i will do a mermaid pour i will shy i have those birth times for you will you send me an email or remind me to send you those numbers birth times yeah she's gonna do like a chart thing i was born at like you were born at like 5 a.m b nah, i was like three it was like two or three in the afternoon mm -mm. Mm -hmm. i asked your mom or maybe i was 5 a.m and you were three in the afternoon fireball math andrea that's exactly what it is i haven't even sipped it yet i'm putting it off look how sweaty Lynn said, okay, this is directed at you. Can Erica take her shots now, or is she still sipping the fireball? That's directed at you. She's asking, not me. Mm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
I got it halfway down. B, I just <laughs> didn't mean it. The thing about alcohol inks and resin is that alcohol inks fade. Y'all, Jacquard contacted us and was like, what's up? Do you want some free stuff? Try for your channel. And I was like, yeah, I would. Let me show you what they sent me. I was like, we mainly use stuff and resin. And they sent me this. Alcohol ink. I mean, do, don't they know that they're selling basically invisible ink for if you use it in resin? <sighs> not even I can sell your alcohol inks because resin. They're not life. It's like they don't know that their own products just aren't going to be cool in resin. Lynn says it's pretty great when you can beat your super old sister and taking shots on your first try. Listen, did you just call me super, super old? old? You are not welcome we'll to come visit that, me we'll in six weeks. Come down next time. She wants to come down in like six <laughs> or seven weeks. Kelly said she did take a shot, Lynn, but it wasn't pretty. Did you show them my shot face? Mm -hmm. V, that's super classified. I guess we're all fam here, whatever. But now you guys know my struggle. Andrea, yes, my oil piece is still leaking. <laughs> Happy Yellow Mermaid Pour is just a pour with like mermaid-esque colors, which is very similar to Peacock Pour, by the way, if you want to like get technical. I want to do another Peacock Pour. Look how fun that is. Very <laughs> elegant, I think. It's a little lumpy. <laughs> lumpy. Beyond said, how'd you get your resin out of your carpet? I spilled resin one time, so now I have a hard spot. We got rid of the you carpet. Oh. Lars, is it really 5.40 a.m. where you're at? Samantha got Recollections Extra Fine Glitter today. Haven't even opened yet and have craft herpes. What the... F That's the best glitter. It's super sparkly. That's almost everything that I used on my glittery cupcake. Did you show them the... Uh, Amanda, bits? I would love to see that. Yeah, I did. Should I said, that's what she said in like two different posts, but it nailed it. Fuego. PJ, I used um, embossing powders in my latest geode, but I didn't heat it up too much because I wanted to keep the lines crisp in the geode. I'm really interested in trying them in another pour, like that I could really heat up with the torch. I'm not mad at it. Laura Van Allen, that's true. Alcohol ink is great for painting on silk. Nora says, so many people use alcohol ink and resin and I don't get it, especially when they sell it. Nora, within a year, those people will come back to the, the artist and be like, yo, this piece of art that you sold me has disappeared, what up? Because you really can't like seal it with like a UV spray if you do like the Petri dish type artwork, which looks super amazing, but it goes nowhere, you know? Andrea Morin, she called you super old, ha ha ha. I heard it, just rub it in. It's funny because every day, Every single day that a young person calls an older person old, they get older. This Lynn knows better. She's just coming at me because I told the story about when she got washed up because of the wave. FYI, he showed your shot face the first time you had fireball, like last week. 
<laughs> Yo. Yo. I'm so half embarrassed. I don't get embarrassed. I'm just half. Um, Rod, a UV protectant will help, but you can't really spray that over. Okay, so let's say you do like alcohol ink on UPO. You would then do a UV protectant over that and then resin it. So the resin is on top of the UV protectant on top of the alcohol ink. That way you still have the glassy coat and still have the vibrancy of the alcohol inks. If you do a Petri pour, you don't really have the opportunity to add the UV protectant, except for if you wanna do it on top of the resin and that will cloudy up your resin, if that makes sense. So it's no bueno. It looks like a black hole plus sign. It looks good. Kaisi says, you guys are hilarious right now. Aren't we hilarious all the time? Or is it just because of the fireball? And because I'm listening to good music. PJ, put one in the sunlight, the like one that you like the least, and just see if it fades. Because I would be interested to know, because I don't do them. I have Petri like molds, but I haven't done one firsthand because of everybody that says it fades which is about 100% of the people I've talked to. So I'd like to know. Thank you, Wandering Art. I love the cupcake too. I'm about to have to do another one. So I'll post a video on it. Who are you doing another one for? Heather that got the Skull oh, Elvis. Yeah. Oh, it's 1.37 p.m. in Nova Scotia. Nope, Northern County, Victoria, Australia. What? I don't know why I saw Nova Scotia out of that. Fireball. Fireball. I blame Fireball. Thanks, Fireball. It's all true. There you go. Close up of what he's doing. Tiger Mouse, you are tardy for the party. Margo, your alcohol ink should be fine with... Because, okay. My uh, cherry blossom painting has been sitting in the sun, but it's not covered in um, resin. So it's, it's stayed pretty well. Rod is sucking up. He said, super old. Erica's like, what, 25? And then Shy said, he's like 27. <laughs> I don't know if you guys are being amazing or if you guys are, you just don't know that I'm actually like 34. Megan said, he's 33. I'll take it. Ellen said, you two will be miserable tomorrow. Actually, we haven't drunk enough to be miserable tomorrow. We actually have a long day of arting. Nope. Partying. Nope. What? Concerting tomorrow. Well, it's, look, at, look at how this turned out. <laughs> this one? It looks kind of flat. Paisley. Yeah, it is paisley. Paisley's. Night, Lori. It's not the fireball, it's the fumes. Thank you, Mark. <laughs> Thanks for letting us know we're getting high from the fumes. Awesome, Clara. PJ, let me know. Sherry, you're like the latest one. We've done like four or five pours so far. <laughs> Judy said, y'all are absolutely fireball funny. <laughs> I accept. Ticey says, so my alcohol ink Petri dishes are a waste of time, question mark. I wouldn't say they're a waste of time. I would say that if they display them anywhere in and around sunlight, 
they m probably will fade. Christina Welch, let me know if it does What's fade. On? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Very subtle, very classy. They are classy. I really like that one. That's my favorite one. Bing, bing, bing. Bing, 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 bing. Even that looks kind of like a swastika. Oh, thank you, Natalie. Tysi says, you guys are always hilarious, but you're extra tonight. Just because we're extra. Andrea Morin says, have the black and white coaster added to the pile. I'm writing it down right now. <laughs> We love it that you guys buy our artwork and our coasters so, like, spontaneously. Like, I love I Actually, love I'll take both. <laughs> Lynn, that would be amazing if it did work like that. Um, I did this piece, um, probably can't see it. I did this, um, let me pull it. No! I did this cherry blossom-esque painting not too long ago, and, well, it was maybe like, what, seven months ago, and it hasn't faded, but there's, it's not in resin and it is an alcohol ink 100 percent alcohol ink on a white masonite so i think it's the resin factor that makes it fade for the petri pores hi d Day string. Night, Nora. And a little fact, your your breath. I got you down for both of them, Andrea. Heat up the resin. I like that. Very subtle. Bethany said, I need a coaster. I've never seen a resin painting in person. Bethany, shoot me an email, thornton at artisttilldeath.com, two T's, two L's, and I'll send you an invoice for a coaster. Let me know your favorite color, and I'll send you one in the mail and surprise you. Mystery coaster. So when you do a resin over alcohol ink, is that on UPO paper? I don't know that I would pour resin over UPO paper. I've never done it, but I feel like it may warp the paper. Y'all need some round canvases too. I will get Greg on that, Khaleesi. Thank you. He's not going to make round canvases. He's making me a lip-shaped canvas. Yeah. Well, I was supposed to do that. Well, you can still do one. Thank you. So how much for that piece? The, the cherry one, blossom? What was that? I think a hundred? The cherry blossom? Oh. Somebody. Oh, other people <laughs> are saying it's so pretty. Ticey says, you two just come live with me for a month and show me everything you know. That'll be $12,000. <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice cherry blossom, likely to pop under resin. Yeah, I just want to make sure that I like it the way it is before I put a resin coat over it. Beyond, you should totally do a pour tomorrow. Oh, Sherry says she's poured resin over Upo and it worked fine. Awesome. The pink one that Jeff just finished. How much do you are you charging for that one? What was that? I don't know what size it was. I want to say one point five. 
125. Have a great flight, Khaleesi. Oh, I know, Andrea. He's definitely up to his elbows in pentagons and hexagons. Billy Phil said, let me find out he's really smurfette with that blue hand. Y'all, it may be true. Judy said, Yupo is a plastic paper and you should be able to resin on it, but it would be pretty messy. If anybody knows, Judy would, because she knows all the things. I trust her with all of it. <laughs> all of it, guys. Trust all of it. Clara said, how much fireball have you had? Kind of late to the party. You sound like you're feeling it pretty good. I've had one shot in total. Well, totally, we've had one of these. Of these. Yeah, in total, I've had one. Is that sad? <gasps> Did you throw that away? Oh. I was like, waste not, want not. You're so cute. Thanks, B. You're, you're the bestest one. one. Lynn said, save the pink one for when I get there and I'll buy it. We'll just make you one while you're here, so it'll be even more unique. Fresh. But I can also hold that one for you. Passion Lotus, that's a great uh, resin for anything that you're going to put any kind of heat on or need to have, like, be super sturdy and scratch resistant. I'm so waste not want not. Y'all don't even know. Billy Phil said the total after two sippies, right? Y'all, I'm a lightweight. It's for real. She is definitely a guys. PJ, I will definitely look that up. Night, Margo. We're about to call it a night, too. We're going to have some brats and go to bed because we got a long day, manana. Oh, tomorrow it we're going to... It's four, so it's not that long. Well, we, we're going to need to pour early. So what do you think, like a noon pour? Or a noon pour? Or in and around the 12 in the afternoon area? Noon? Uh, yeah, noon. Probably noon. Noon manana. So that will be, we have to be 13 hours from now. At the concert at 4. Yeah, we got to be at a concert at 4. So we're going to be pouring for you guys at noon central time tomorrow. So that's like 13 hours from right now. I hope you guys can make it. We are... I can't even tell you, like, my brain hurts at how much I appreciate you guys tuning in and watching us for so long and for contributing to our channel like you have. It's bananas. Like, there's no better word than bananas. Um, tomorrow we're going to go see BFD concert, which I have no idea who all is there. I think it stands for a big effing deal. Effing deal. Uh, Perfect Circles headlining, STP. I thought you were about to say STD, but go ahead. No. Um, it's not I disturbed. Other, I don't know. Other bands. Okay. Yeah. So, we'll see you all tomorrow at noon tomorrow. We will not have our regularly scheduled 8 p.m. pour. We'll post on our Facebook and Instagram, all of those things, so that you can know what time we will be here tomorrow if you have a question please shoot us an email at thornton at artist till death.com don't forget this in two t's two l's if you Jeez. ordered something tonight please send me an email so i remember to put it down because as you know i've had one shot of fireball which is too much for me and i will probably forget if you want to be a part of the lupus giveaway please use the hashtag atdart post a pour that's predominantly purple and you will be entered in to win we're picking our top three favorites and we'll be giving it away on the 31st of this month for everybody that's donated and contributed to our channel, we will be giving away a piece also on the 31st for you guys. We'll do a live drawing during that pour. So, I think I said everything I need to say. We will see you guys tomorrow. We love you so much. Thank you for being part of the ATD fam. 
Bye. I said bye. You dork. <laughs>